And finally, the occupation of the Pulaski Park. I just want to bring to the board's attention that we have a group of protesters down there that are part of the, I guess, uh, protesting corporate greed and bank greed and everything else, uh, camping out down in Pulaski Park. Um, I talked to Russ Sinkowitz, Chief Sinkowitz, about this. Apparently, when the protest started, they were able to occupy four or five parking spaces downtown, and then they wanted to stay overnight. Russ made the decision to usher them into the park rather than have them sleeping on the streets of Northampton, sidewalks, parking areas, and so on. They've been there since uh, the protest started. To my understanding, there's three or four people that sleep overnight, and on any given day, there's at least two or three people continuing the protest on a 24-hour basis. Um, they wanted to set up tents, they weren't allowed to do that, so they're sleeping out underneath the stars. Um, they are eating in the park. Um, I'm sure they're using someone's facilities somewhere. Uh, I don't know where. Uh, I haven't heard any complaints from the Academy of Music at this point. But uh, they do not have a permit from the Department of Public Works to be there. I just want to make you aware of it. Um, talking with the police chief, he thought that they are they're being civil. They're cleaning up after themselves, and he does not see it to be an issue as long as they're respecting uh, what the police officers are requiring down there. So it's fairly peaceful. I walked through there today. There was a gentleman down there playing guitar and singing along, and a couple other people holding some placards out there. Didn't someone come in to get a permit, though? I was told that. I didn't. That's what Ann said. To, yeah. He got all the information to get a permit, but we haven't seen anything come back on a permit. So I'm not sure if there's any direction the board wants to take on this. You do control what happens down at the park. Uh, like I said, the, the police department says as long as they're civil and courteous and uh, abiding by what they feel is being reasonable, that they don't have an issue in the park. Do we have any um, any group that's gotten a permit from us that's coming up soon that might be required? And the, the question will be, when they come to exercise their <coughs> permit? I don't know offhand if we have any conflicts at this moment. I can get the dates. That's but that's really the thing thought. that I wanted to talk to the acting mayor about today and uh, was waiting for a return phone call. Make sure that he's okay with what's going on in the park also. They seem to have a general assembly at 3 o'clock every afternoon to talk about issues and share. Large group? It had been larger earlier in the week. It seems to be diminishing. But it's not enough to have to use that newfangled microphone system that they're doing. Shout outs. <laughs> So, you know, uh, Russ also talked, our Chief Sinkwood talked about the fact that cold weather's coming, rain tonight might be a deterrent, and we'll see how long it lasts. It's supposed to be cold, too, tonight. I just got toast. I really spent them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, they had a um, Polish Heritage Parade on Monday. Mm -hmm. yes. So they were there. Oh, you would never we didn't know. Hear, no, no, we didn't hear. It was, but I mean, no the issue. protesters yeah. were also there. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't hear anything really back from them, yeah, so... Yeah. If there's nothing else. Okay. Oh, that's a big parade. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's a parade. Any other comments? Just let this lie. All right. 